Hi, I'm Samantha McDouglas from TheBridgeTeachers.com. Come look over my shoulder at a bidding problem. Let's start by taking a look at the auction. If you need to pause the video, pause the video. East was a dealer and passed. Our hand opened one club. Our left hand opponent bid one spade. Our partner doubled. Our right hand opponent bid two diamonds. We passed. Our left hand opponent bid two spades and our partner bid three spades. Our right hand opponent doubled. If you need to, pause, take a look at the auction. What would you bid now? I would bid three now, Trump. So my agreement with my partners and the agreement that I like to teach is that if the opponents have bid only one suit, I ask my partner for a stopper by Q bidding that suit. And my rationale for that is if I could bid no trump, I would bid no trump. So when I bid the opponent's suit, there's some reason I don't want to bid no trump. Most of the time, this is because I don't have a stopper. Uh, sometimes it's because of points. Most of the time, it's because I don't have a stopper. So this is similar to a Western qubit, but it's not exactly a Western qubit. The idea is, is I'm looking for three no trump. If my partner has a stopper, they bid three no trump. When two suits have been bid by the opponents, we do the opposite thing. Well, now we're much more similar to an Eastern qubit where we bid the stopper we have. So in this case, where two suits were bid, spades and diamonds, I would expect my partner to actually be showing a stopper in spades by bidding three spades and asking me to bid three no trump if I had a diamond stopper. Since I have a diamond stopper, I'm going to bid three no trump. So the agreement that I would have with my partner is, if we don't have a fit in a major and I cubid the opponent's suit looking for no trump, I'm saying I don't have a stopper. If you have a stopper, bid no trump. If the opponents have bid two suits and I cubid the opponent's suit in this scenario, then I'm saying I have a stopper here, but I don't have a stopper in the other suit. This agreement is really useful, but it's important to keep straight whether I'm showing a stopper or asking for the stopper. For me, it makes a whole lot of sense that if it's only one suit, if I had the stopper, I would bid no trump. So by bidding the suit, I'm saying I don't have a stopper. When two suits have been bid, now it makes sense to show the stopper. I have a stopper here in spades is what I would expect my partner to be saying, asking me if I can stop the diamond suit and that's why I would bid three no trump. Let's take a quick look at the hand. You can see the partner has a problem over two spades because partner doesn't really have diamonds stopped. On this auction, it's a little bit weird for East to be bidding like they did, so there could very reasonably be a very strong diamond suit over here. And if East does have the ace, king, queen, jack of diamonds, North doesn't have a stopper. So North was concerned about the diamonds and bid three spades, saying, hey, I have those spades stopped, but I don't have the diamonds stopped. If you have the diamonds stopped, bid three no trump. Since South has the diamonds stopped, South should bid three no trump. On this hand, this agreement allows us to find three no trump, which is a much better contract than clubs or even diamonds. And you can see that without this agreement, without having a specific agreement about whether I'm showing or asking for a stopper, the partnership is in trouble because they have trouble finding three no trump with two suits bid by the opponent. So really useful agreement. You want to be connected with your partner. It takes just a second to talk about, hey, if the opponents have bid one suit and I cubed that suit, am I showing a stopper or asking for a stopper? My agreement would be that I'm asking for a stopper. If the opponents have bid two suits and I bid one of their suits, am I showing a stopper or am I asking for a stopper? My agreement would be with two suits, I'm showing a stopper. So this situation, again, only comes up when we don't have a major suit fit and we're looking for no trump. Obviously, there are a whole bunch of different qubits out there, and you want to identify what kind of qubit it is. This particular qubit, where we're looking for a three no trump contract, is usually asking or showing a stopper.